beginnt jetzt. Nach dem Ladebildschirm. This trip to the countryside will be good for you, Holmes. Hmm. As your friend and your doctor, I really do recommend that you give yourself a complete change of scene. Fresh air, brisk walks, bird watching, chopping wood. Sounds intoler I mean, certainly it sounds delightful. But you haven't yet told me who your friend is. The one we're going to visit. He is a bee lover. A bee lover? Do you mean that he keeps bees? That must be Mrs. Hudson, bringing the warm cloth that I requested. There is someone to see you, Mr. Holmes. I have no time. Send whoever it is away. Yes, Holmes, I really think we ought to leave now. Mycroft. Oh. Sherlock. <laughs> oh, uh, Mr. Holmes? Perhaps you don't remember me. I'm Dr. Watson. Uh, we met at the Diogenes Club a few years ago. I documented our encounter in a short story I gave the title The Greek Interpreter. He does remember you, Watson. My brother remembers everything, and that is why he is so valuable to the government. We're about to depart for the train station. I know. You know? Sherlock, I need your help. There are people who presently threaten both our country and the Crown itself. You must help us with those methods of yours. Need? Help? Those are not words I would readily associate with you, Mycroft. I wrote you a letter, but you did not reply. And this is not about politics. It's about people. People similar to those whom you pretend to defend in your petty detective affairs. Everything is about politics with you, Mycroft. I'm not interested. Have some of your agents, your spies, or worse, undertake this job of yours. You are defending your people, and they have little to do with the people I choose to help. I can assure you. That is the point. You think exactly as they do. Who are they? The Merry Men. He is talking about the Merry Men, a band of idealistic terrorists. Sherlock, do please think about it. They are planning something diabolical. Your country needs you. You need me, Mycroft, and you are not the country. Although, if your waistline expands very much further... Mrs. Hudson, tea will not be necessary. Dr. Watson, the train conductor, Mr. Parker, is aware that you will be seven minutes late. You are in the fourth car. The train will be waiting for you. Sherlock, enjoy your time in Staffordshire. And do, please, at least write to me on your return. Ich habe ein Souvenir erhalten. Die Harpune, mit der der schwarze Peter getötet wurde. Hängt sie hier irgendwo an der Wand? Ich kann die Briefe nehmen. Die Rache eines Harpuniers. The Strand. Der Fall um den erschütternden Mord an dem ehemaligen Kapitän Peter Carey, auch bekannt unter dem Namen Schwarzer Peter, ist gelöst. Die Beweise, die Scotland Yard von sicherer Quelle erhalten hat, waren mehr als ausreichend, um festzustellen, dass Peter Carey von Pablo Coventrao, einem seiner früheren Harponiere, ermordet wurde. Allerdings wird es nicht zu einer Gerichtsverhandlung kommen können, denn Coventrao wurde vor kurzem tot aufgefunden, gestorben, ohne Gewalteinwirkung. Möglicherweise ist er an den Gewissensbissen ob seines schrecklichen Verbrechens gestorben. Ich denke nicht. Achso, und hier können wir unsere Fälle nochmal einsehen. Sehr schön, sehr schön. Tab bringt uns im Moment. Warum? Was willst du denn mit Tab? Was willst du denn mit Tab? Ich habe mir das doch angeschaut. Ah, wir sind, wir sind ja klassisch. My archive. I can always consult with it if needed. Klassisch bekleidet. Wir brauchen nichts untersuchen. Wir haben noch nichts. Lass uns gehen. Holmes, please call a cab while I pack my suitcase. We should be late for the train. 
Ja, äh, sie schon wieder. Look after Mrs. Hudson for us, Toby. Na gut. Toby regelt das hier. Wir. Watson, I'll hold a cab for us. We leave in five minutes for the station. Hol die Kutsche. <lacht> Eine Woche später. Er war nie wieder gesehen. Ach, diese Wartezeiten. Ah, jetzt. Ich sehe das immer kaum, wenn dann da steht. Da ich die drücken. Brr, what a gloomy night. It was warmer inside the waiting hall. Since the station master told us that the train is about to arrive, we should not have to wait very much longer. Yes, at last. Attention, the train is arriving at the station. Please stand well away from the platform edge. I'll take your bags and your blasted archive suitcase. But, Holmes, the headlight, it's faded away. Something is wrong. I can't hear any sound from the incoming train. Excuse me, sir. Can you explain what has happened? I, I don't know. It, it's as if the train vanished into thin air. Holmes, say something. Quick. Fetch a lantern and let us take a look. Oh, oh. It's too dark. Only fog and rails, nothing else. Uh, there is no use in stumbling around here at night. We will come back tomorrow. Sehr früh am nächsten Morgen. Uhrzeiten, wo wir gar nicht erst aufstehen. Ach, wie toll! Jetzt sitzen wir im Zug. Oder? Nee, das ist eine Kutsche im Freien. Entschuldigung. Ich dachte, das wäre der Zug. Herleitung? Wir haben doch überhaupt noch... Wir haben doch gar nichts. Gott sagen. Well, here we are again at Evesham Station. We have a full day ahead. Let us begin our investigation. Lass mich mal hier hoch. Ist denn eine nette Bahnbeamte hier? Ach, das sind noch so eine schönen alten Aufenthaltsräume. So eine Warteräume. Die man jetzt auch gerne im Winter einfach mal abschließt. Total sinnfrei. Damit man hier sich totfriert. First of all, let us examine the area where the train disappeared. N natürlich. Das sollte das Erste sein. Wir sagen niemandem Bescheid. <lacht> Wäre ja Quatsch. So, irgendwo da hinten ist er verschwunden. Was ist denn F? This is the place where we saw the train vanish last night. Ich sehe schon. Wo fangen wir denn an? Die Eisenbahn schon. Railway sleepers. Nothing unusual. Die leere Flasche. A discarded item, possibly thrown from the train. There are no tracks or footprints on the ground. The rails have not been touched. There's nothing unusual here. Das ist nicht viel. There are no signs to indicate that the train ran off the track. Nor are there any other traces. There is nothing whatsoever. There are no clues. But then, a negative result is also a result. Oh, I see what you're getting at. No clues and you're smiling. Yes, Watson, I do smile on occasion. This mystery appears very promising. 
This investigation won't be simple. We shall require a map of the region. Perhaps the station master could lend us one. Wir hätten ja gleich fragen können, aber nein. Wir müssen natürlich erst alles anschauen. Gut, dann gehen wir zurück zu dem netten Bahnhofsvorsteher. Hallo, hallo? Hallo? Ist hier jemand? Ähm, hallo? Ach, hier. Na, Mensch. Huhu. Good morning. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sherlock Holmes, and this is my friend and colleague, Dr. Watson. Yes, I remember you. I'm Station Master Everett. You were here last night. So, you are Mr. Holmes, the great detective. Will you be investigating what happened? I shall indeed. It is extraordinary that an entire train could disappear like that. And to think of all the poor people inside it, the passengers, the driver. Ja, irgendwas muss doch da passiert sein. Schauen wir ihn uns doch mal näher an. Graue Haare. Ehrenbahnhofsvorsteher. Hier ist er dreckig. Ehering, verheiratet. Could you please give us any details about the train? Well, there was nothing so very special about it. At least not that I can recall. My memory's not what it used to be. <laughs> However, if you need it, you can have the train composition report. It's inside my office. Da, wo wir gerade waren. Ach so. I would be glad to have a detailed map of the local railway district. But of course, please, take the one that's pinned inside the waiting hall. See you later, my good man. Ja, jetzt haben wir natürlich ihn äh, auf unserer Liste. Das wurde uns gerade auf Tab angezeigt. Aber das interessiert uns ja noch reichlich wenig. Hier. Message to all stations. Mr. Robinson is located at Burlington Station. A new telegram. I think we should meet this, Mr. Robinson. Lösen Sie das Reservoir mit dem verschwundenen Zug. Sammeln Sie mehr Informationen über den verschwundenen Zug. Besorgen Sie sich eine Streckenkarte der Eisenbahnlinie dieser Region. Das wäre für die Ermittlungen von großem Nutzen. Zu so, so Zugzusammenstellung. Zu so, 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 Aha. Special Wagon ordered by Mr. Robinson. Here is the train set. Da wäre vielleicht gut zu wissen, wer dieser Mr. Robinson ist. A Telegraph. Mhm. Das klang gerade sehr vertrauenserweckend. Eine Karte des... St ah, da. Nee. Das ist nicht der Streckenabschnitt, das ist die gesamte mögliche Strecke dieser Welt. Englands natürlich. Schauen wir uns weiter um. Hier ist keine Karte. Railway Post Bags. Hm, eine Streckenkarte. Warte. War da noch was? Nein. Da war nichts weiter. Unser Tobi wieder draußen am Meckern. Die Streckenkarte, na das ist doch nett. In der Nähe ist ein adäquates Erdloch und daneben ein See. This map will be useful. Ah, 
Ah, jetzt haben wir eine Karte. Sehr schön. Hier ist er verschwunden. Ein Steinbruch oder sowas. So sieht's aus. Gut. Wir wollen aber mit den netten Herren von der Bahn sprechen. Ausnahmsweise nicht von der deutschen Bahn. Was ist denn das da drüben? Lagerhaus. Eine kleine Lagerhalle. This part is probably from a locomotive. From a locomotive. Haben sie die auseinandergebaut? This part is probably from a locomotive. An old locomotive bell. This place serves as a storage area for the station. Hm. Vielleicht war das ja kein ganzer Zug, sondern bloß so ein Teilzug, um uns zu verwirren. Das ergibt absolut keinen Sinn. Oder der Zug musste gesehen werden, warum auch immer. According to the train composition report, there was a special wagon. What does that entail? That's a highly secure car, ordered by a private party. Uh, it is generally to carry something of value. Uh, those wagons have iron walls, you know, without any windows. Uh, and they're fitted with a complex key lock. That is important information. Do you know what was inside this particular wagon? Certainly not. No, that's private. And it's not my responsibility to allot the wagons to whoever. Mm -hmm. Was there anything exceptional about any of the passengers aboard the train? What do you mean? Like officials? Oh, I wouldn't know. Oh, oh, but now that you mention it, yes, there was something. There was a message from Bridlington Station saying that the train had been delayed because of an issue with the passengers. But what kind of problem that they didn't say? That is interesting. You mentioned a problem at Bridlington Station. I should like to visit this station. Could you mark it on the local map? Of course. It's a suburban railway station. You might take a cab there. Eine Kutsche. Wie See you later, my good man. Ja. Dann bleibt uns ja nichts anderes übrig, als genau dorthin zu tapern. Bridlington. Das ist unser Ziel. Na, haben wir wieder die schöne Kutsche? Natürlich haben wir die schöne Kutsche. Diesmal Blick auf Watson. Kann er mal probieren? Ich glaube, wir können hier noch nichts zusammen packen. Jedenfalls nichts Sinnvolles. Nett. Klein, aber fein. So sagt man doch. Ja, gehen wir aus dem Weg. Ist der Aufenthaltsraum? Ja. Die warten hier. Ah, Mr. Robinson. Wütender Fargas. Du, zuerst. Fangen wir bei Ihnen an. Good day to you, gentlemen. How may I help you? Good day to you, sir. My name is Sherlock Holmes. I am investigating the unfortunate disappearance of last night's train. I see. Uh, I'm Station Master Bertram, but my supervisor has not informed me about this. I do not know if... Uh, do not worry. I have only a few questions. Als erstes <lacht> schauen wir ihn uns mal näher an. Instructions to Station. <lacht> Eine Anleitung. Die Vorschriften immer dabei. Tinte. Tinte. 
Station Master Everett from Evesham told us that you reported a problem with some passengers last night. Indeed. This train is a regular line for those who work at Nottingham. But yesterday, everyone was asked to get off the train here at my station. I've no idea why, and it delayed the train. But the worst of it is that now I have to deal with two furious passengers who are complaining about the company's service. They stayed here the whole night. But people do not usually pay much attention to the regulations, you see. There are very strict and clear rules. Paragraph 234 of Article 2G-43 states that in the event of a complaint, you must... Yes, yes, thank you. I understand. <laughs> Abgesehen davon. Irgendwas Ungewöhnliches? Apart from the passengers disembarking, genau. did you notice anything else that was unusual last night? I did. And I mentioned it in my report to our higher management on the matter. What was it? Sorry, but I can't tell you. The station master's reports are confidential. Confidential, you say? How long have you been working here? I have worked here long enough to be uh, quite capable of managing a railway station. Unerfahrener Vorsteher. Let me speak frankly, Mr. Bertram. Your age and your lack of confidence in your position are quite apparent. You cannot deny that you have only recently completed your studies. I was at the top of my class. Listen here, young man. I am aware that you wish to protect yourself behind all these regulations, but I represent the law. And you are obstructing the investigation of an important case. I would suggest that you cooperate with Mr. Holmes. Think of your career. Ah, that is... Well, I'll tell you everything. First of all, I scolded the ticket inspector, for it was he who asked the passengers to leave the train. It was not his right to do so. He was very rude. And then, later on, I received a most peculiar telegram from my colleague at Chesterfield Station, the next stop along the line. Seltsames Telegram? What did the telegram say? Well, that was the peculiar thing. It was almost unreadable. It was full of errors and awfully vague. It was hard to understand if the train had correctly passed that station or not. You can read it for yourself. Yeah, no. We ought to visit Chesterfield Station. We need to confirm if the station master saw the train or not. Back north, Chesterfield, Zuhlner, Nummer 324, Ankunft. Und 030, Abfall im 035. Aha. Aha. Oh, das ist eine Zwischenhaltestelle. Fangen wir uns erstmal so um. Weil T drücken ist ja dann immer einfach. Ne, was tust du? Ne. Bleibt da nicht hängen. A telegraph. Aha. The insurance policy for Robinson's machine. A significant sum. Ja, Zufall? Ich denke nicht. Versicherungsschein Nummer 256458. Versicherung abgeschlossen von Thomas... Thomas? Thomas? L. Robinson für seinen Prototyp mit der Bezeichnung Autonomer Stromgenerator. Diese Versicherung deckt den Totalschaden oder den wirtschaftlichen Totalschaden am Prototyp bis zu einer Höhe von 50% des Gegenstandswertes. Maximale Deckungssumme 15.000 Pfund. Ein Jahr verlängerbar. Faszinierend. Weißt du davon Don't touch was? Anything, please. Nö. Aber du. Fang aber erstmal dich. Nur mal so. This is an absolute scandal. It's always the same with these real companies. No respect for the customer. Ja, nur weil Spaß macht. Vielleicht brauchen wir es ja später auch noch, man weiß ja nie. Der Bart sieht relativ gepflegt aus, muss ich sagen. Erstaunlich. Aha. 
Das wäre was raue Haut. Arbeite. Please calm down, sir. What is your concern? Concern? What is my concern? I'll tell you what my concern is. Last night, I were on the train, as usual, with my colleague, heading home. Then along came this ridiculous ticket inspector, who started arguing that our tickets were invalid. He made us get off the train, and he was extremely rude about it. Were you aboard the train that vanished last night? Yes. I heard that it disappeared. But I don't care, because we would have stopped before then anyway. Our tickets were valid, and no doubt about it. And then, to top it all, the ticket inspector pushed everyone else out too, except for a bunch of rich. Well, of course, their type don't need a ticket. Mhm, da waren also noch welche da. Can you recall anything more specific about this fortunate group? Well, yes. They were all foreigners. Spanish-looking toffs with snake eyes. Goodbye, sir. Das war doch schon mal ganz interessant. Und ich sehe gerade, dass wir schon völlig über der Zeit sind. Ganze sechs, fast sieben Minuten. Deswegen sehen wir uns in der nächsten Folge. Bis dahin. Tschüss.